everyone welcome back to my channel i have another plan with me for you guys um, for june uh, 26th through july 2nd and this is the last week that i am going to be planning live with you guys everything else from here on until i get home is going to be pre-planned i have been debating on whether or not to do this my normal way or just to do the whole thing this week uh, it looks like there's a possibility I might be leaving on Wednesday. So because the possibilities of me leaving this week are super, super high, I'm going to go ahead and just plan the whole week out already. And you'll still get it on time though. But I'll just show you what I have. This is a birthday week in my ha family. My dad's birthday is today and my daughter's birthday is on Friday. She's going to be 13. So I have this Libyan Co. kit. This is um, one of the mystery kits from a couple months ago. It came with a little Easter freebie, so it was like in April or something. So we have all the deco, we have the full boxes, the date cover-ups, and extra little things. We have the full boxes, the washi, the littles, and the half boxes. We have some little functional icons and smaller boxes, scallop boxes, and lots of headers and to do's, to go's, to calls, that kind of stuff. And then we have all of the washi. And this was still when she did the washi in one big strip. She has since then changed her washi and it no longer comes like this. Hey guys, so I decided to go ahead and do a voiceover. I was having so many issues with this spread that I ended up stopped talking because I was just getting overly frustrated. So the first thing that I did wrong was right here. So the week here starts on Sunday, but I didn't realize it started on Sunday when I first started putting the numbers down. So instead of dating it Monday through Sunday, I dated it Sunday through Saturday and then had to go and fix it all. So I cut a little bit of it out while I'm sitting there whining at myself that I had done it wrong and then I get to fixing it. Unfortunately, that means that the numbers don't quite lie down flat. Even though they're matte removable, they still get a little crinkly when you pick them up. And so none of the stickers lay quite right like they're supposed to anymore. But this was just the start. There's a couple other things that happened while I was doing this spread that I thought, okay, you know, maybe it's better just to wait and do a voiceover for you guys. So I, it is now Tuesday. I filmed this yesterday and I, as long as everything goes well, we leave tomorrow. And because of that, I'm getting everything prepped ahead of time so that the channel won't have any lags, that I will still be here for you guys. And of course, I'll be answering any comments or anything. So oh, I'm still going to be around. I just won't be at this computer. And I thought it would just be easier to get it all done ahead of time. I will have a computer on me though and my camera, so we're hoping to be able to get some vlogs up or something fun to be able to keep record of this trip. I'm a little nervous. Elise is very excited. And I think my nerves are more of the fact that there's a lot of unknowns. We are taking a military um, Mac flight, or it's a space A, so as long as there's room for us, that's how we will take our flight. So we will get up bright and early tomorrow morning and find out if they have room for us. And if they do have room for us, I'm sure you'll see something vlog-ish soon. And if not, you'll still see something vlog-ish soon because that means that we had to take a different day, but we'll still go regardless. It's just depending on which day we go. Tomorrow the flight is at 6 a.m. and it's a direct flight all the way to California. So we're hoping to be able to be on that one. So, so far you've seen me put the washi down and I had a little bit of a hiccup with the washi, but nothing too bit serious. Here is mess up number two. I think this is getting to the point where I stopped talking during the, 
you know, walk through portion of it. Instead of putting the meals down for the rest of the week, I put presents down for the whole week. And so I have to pick up and move all of those last three stickers because I picked up the wrong ones. But you know, no big deal. I went ahead and stuck one of the presents on yesterday or the day that I was actually doing it because it was my daddy's birthday. And then I'm going to stick the other one on Friday because it's Lisa's birthday. And she just keeps dancing around the house talking about how she's almost 13. And I remember being 13. And I remember being excited about being 13. But girl is ecstatic about being 13. I don't know what it is, but she finally made it to her teenage years. And I don't know if she wasn't sure she was going to survive that long or if it's just a much bigger deal than I remember it being. Uh, for people who are closer to 13 than I am, let me know because I, I remember being excited, but I don't remember being this excited. Maybe it's because we are getting ready to leave. She has all of her stuff packed up. Everything's ready to go. She's even showered and in her travel clothes. So all she has to do is go to bed tonight and all we have to do is drag her out of bed tomorrow morning. And of course, because if she's anything like me, she won't sleep very well tonight and we'll both be groggy and obnoxious in the morning, but hopefully we'll be able to sleep on the plane and make up for it. I have no idea how long a direct flight is all the way to California. I know that the flight that we took from Chicago to Japan was like 13 hours, but I'm not sure how long this one's going to be. I'm hoping it's not going to be, you know... 13 hours. I know if we were going through Hawaii, it would be an eight hour flight to Hawaii and then another eight hours into California. But I know for a fact that we're not hitting Hawaii if we go tomorrow. If we go on Thursday, we will hit Hawaii. So we're trying to go tomorrow to have our best chance at actually making it on the flight. So we will see what happens. I only have a little bit more packing to do. And this was the last YouTube thing that I have to do <laughs> before I am done. And I am excited about it. I'm excited to have the next couple of weeks all planned out and pre-planned for you guys. And I don't know. I'm excited. So my daddy turned 59 yesterday or today, depending on what time zone you live in. Um, for him, it's Monday, but for me, it's Tuesday. So last time I talked to him, he said he had a lot of fun for his birthday and he went hiking and had a good day. And I was very happy to hear that. He doesn't get out enough. He's got a very demanding job and that causes him a lot of stress. And so anytime that he actually gets to get out and have fun is a good birthday for him. And as you have all heard, Elisa is extremely excited about her birthday. Her only stipulation was that she didn't want to actually fly on her birthday. And if all goes well, we will be in California for her birthday. I don't know if we're going to be in San Francisco or not, or if we're still going to be at on base, but either way, we will not be flying. I plan to have us have a couple of days just to chill and relax. And if we leave on Wednesday, her birthday's on Friday, I'm guessing we'll still be on the base. That way we just have a couple of days to chill out and relax and not have to worry about anything. We'll be reading, watching TV, watching YouTube, sleeping a lot, eating real food, just to something to get our bodies back in the swing of things. Because I don't know about you, but traveling always just is hard on me. So I want to make sure that we are well coped. All right. Mistake number four, I think. I put the boxes down wrong. And so I had to pull up the boxes and then redo it. Did anybody notice that I... I am setting this whole thing up differently than I normally do because I messed up to start with. So I put the little like headers on the full boxes instead of the check boxes. And so I ended up just kind of going with it and using more headers, which is why you have today's and to do's when I normally don't have both, but I messed it up. I'm telling you, this was not my day. <laughs> I was having a lot of fun playing with the stickers once I stopped messing up, but really that didn't stop the whole way through. I kept making little mistakes here and there and pulling up stickers. And if this was pretty much any other kit, it would have been like doom. But because it's a 
uh, Libby & Co. and almost all of her stickers are removable, I was okay. But yeah, I was not happy about this. I don't know, stress of leaving, trying to get everything done. I'm not sure what happened, but. So I managed to put some uh, plans down for Monday and Tuesday, but I didn't do anything for the rest of the week because like you've probably heard or about to hear through this entire week, we don't have any plans. I know exactly what we're doing. Well, for the most part, I know exactly what we're doing while we're in New Orleans and Pensacola and um, Jacksonville and Miami. We, we have some, you know, touristy stuff to do in those towns, but we have some basic plans. But the whole before New Orleans and after Miami part are totally up in the air. We don't know when our flights are going to be for sure. We don't know where we're going to be staying. We don't know pretty much anything. And it's it's hard on me. I'm, I'm a planner and having so many things unknown makes for a scary trip. But I know it'll all work out. I'm just, uh, you know. <laughs> Here's another mess up. You know how I like to keep my full boxes and my little header boxes from matching? Well, I almost matched them on accident. I was just having no luck whatsoever here. And if I had thought things through a little bit more, I probably would have done it differently. At least for Saturday and Sunday, I would have done it differently. But I didn't. I didn't think things through. So I kind of just won it most of the time. I do like the way it turned out though. It's very bright, it's very colorful, it's very cheery, it's very happy birthday. And since my birthday is not a big deal to me right now, but my daughter's birthday is, because you know the whole reason that she's going on this trip with me is because it's her birthday. And she has a concert to go to, her very first one with her best friend and her mommy. I'm not sure how excited she's about the last part because she wants a new outfit and she wants to wear makeup and I'm a prude and told her no. Um, the outfit, no, because we don't have a lot of room in our luggage. And I did bring an extra bag, but I don't want to have to use it. And the makeup part, I'm approved because I wasn't allowed to wear makeup until I was 16. And if you've seen my videos, you know that I still don't wear makeup because I don't know how. And it's an absolute amazement to Elise that I have no idea how to wear makeup. She's like, well, why don't I teach you? And I'm like, how are you going to learn? And she goes, YouTube. <laughs> and I know that it's possible to completely learn how to put up makeup on, on YouTube. I just, I don't know. Every time I start to try, I end up messing up so bad. And you would think that taking all the art classes I have in my life, that I would be able to put paint on my own face. But it's not working. On a canvas, sure. On my face, nope, not happening. And of course, that's, you know, annoys at least to no end because if I'm not wearing makeup that means she's not wearing makeup and if she's not wearing makeup she feels left out because they're going to a concert and she wants to look pretty and I'm like you know you're not going to be anywhere near the stage the chances of you being able to see um Shawn Mendes is probably not likely but she's just like no 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 I still want to try I still want to try and of course they're um, joking about all the things they want to do while they're in Miami and how they want to bring their bathing suits. And, I'm, and of course, we're teasing her and we're like, so you're going to try to wear a bathing suit to the concert? Is this a whole new look for you? And she starts laughing and she's like, no, because the, uh, the hotel we have has a pool. And it's one of those rooftop pools. And of course, everyone's I'm excited about the view because the view from the rooftop pool is amazing. But Elise and Sasha are excited about the pool on the roof. And they're both planning out what they're going to wear and how they're going to look. And Elise packed numerous bathing suits. So she had options. And I'm like, you girl, your luggage is too small for this many bathing suits. And she's like, oh, well, <laughs> like, okay, whatever. She wants to be a doll. That's fine with me. I don't care. So at this point, I have pretty much all my stickers laid down. The only thing that I'm going to do now is go through and write a few things in. Um, I've been trying to keep up better and keeping my lists more straight. And it pretty much seems like unless I have an actual outing of some sort planned, like you'll see today I have a date night planned because I figured if we didn't work out, uh, we were going to go on a date and our 
scheduled off day was today. And so we were debating on what to do. And his comment was that he can work out anytime this whole month while I'm gone, but he's only going to have this one chance to have a date with me, which made me all gushy and go, aww. So we went on a date instead of working out, which is fine. I put get IDs down, but I didn't have a better sticker for it. So I used the little credit card sticker, which we did that yesterday so that I can actually go on the flight because my ID was about to expire. And so I would have been able to get to California, but I wouldn't have been able to get home, which presents a problem. You know, the whole coming back is kind of nice. Am I supposed to send my daughter ahead? But we got that done yesterday. The place was supposed to close at 3.30 and we didn't even get in until 4.30. So they were so backed up. But so the rest of the day, it looks like I have pretty much everything done. I've uploaded everything I needed to do. I We had a little date night. I am 99% done with packing. I just need to do the last minute things like toothbrush, deodorant, brush, um, cords that I'm going to be using tonight. Just those last minute things that I'm going to need in the meantime. So here on Wednesday, I was marking down the two flights that were available, but by the time I went and checked the actual times for the flight, they had changed the itinerary. And so there was only one flight instead of two. And the time changed again. It went from 6, 7.30 to like 6.10. These flights are going to be the death of me trying to figure them all out. So here is the finished spread and I used quite a few stickers as you will see, but I still have tons and tons of them left. If nothing else is learned from this is that Libby and Co gives you a lot of stickers in her mystery kits. I will talk to you guys soon. Love you lots. Bye.